Much I want to go out to my co-anchor Marcus Walter this morning, who's been live on our roads from the east side now uh, into the Belvedere area. What are you seeing out there, Marcus? Well, one of the thing, one of the things we are seeing, and hopefully you can still hear me. One of the things we are seeing is that uh, people are definitely driving a little faster out here as we head toward Belvedere. But at the same time, we're seeing a little bit more of the roadway as well. So I think that's uh, the balance with that. But we are definitely dealing with snow still on the roadways. I'll flip the camera around so you can actually see the roadways. We're coming up to a light here, and we see plenty of cars stopped here. We have not seen any emergency vehicles or any accidents so far this morning. So that is definitely good news but we are noticing traffic out here still and we just got off the highway interstate 90 that is and one of the things we noticed is that the highways in my opinion are not in good condition uh, there's tons of snow or plenty of snow on the roadways you can barely make out the lanes and so i think that will be the story over the next hour or so until plows can officially get out there and help clear the roadway. So definitely keep that in mind. If you are planning to travel on the highways, uh, just know you'll likely run into, I would say, maybe more treacherous or more slick situations. So definitely take it easy uh, this morning. But we are heading toward Belvedere. We wanted to check out the Belvedere area, uh, something outside of Rockford to see how it is uh, in those particular locations outside of Rockford. And so far, one of the things we're noticing on State Route 20 where we are heading east, uh, we can see a little more of the road at times, but we're noticing cars are moving a little quicker as well. And the Illinois Department of Transportation, uh, one of their big recommendations is that anytime you're dealing with winter weather, you want to take it slow. Slow braking, slow acceleration, slow driving, uh, that will help keep you safe and the sometimes dangerous conditions. But for now, we'll send it back to you all in the studio, but we are definitely noticing slick conditions and we are definitely taking precautions as well as we travel. All right.